so many of you have been asking me to make a video on what's going on in the world. Is the world coming to an end? Crisis in Ukraine, crisis in Israel. What's going on? What does astrology say? And there are so many videos out there on what's happening astrologically. But what I feel is more important at this time is to realize that your own thoughts project outwards into the world and create your own consciousness. And if you are focused on strife, on worry, on reading the news feed, on stress, on terror, on thinking thoughts that things are going one way which is down. This is the reality you are going to create for yourself and for the world. The world is going through an extremely stressful and important time. The world is a being. The world is sentient. We are not alone, we are in a whole cosmos and there's a sun, there's other planets that are going in celestial orbit and each of them relies on the other. And our thoughts, our actions, our way of being is vital at this time. So rather than tune into negativity, watch your thoughts and try to have a calm and optimistic demeanor that is not based on a false sense of security, but is based on a calm knowing that everything is unfolding according as it should and that your own energy is part of the great divine plan. And how you are every day and what you think is creating tomorrow, creating our future world. This has to be experienced as a feeling within you, a feeling that life matters that your thoughts matter and that how you spend every moment of your day matters. Take care what you put into your brain through the internet. Take care how much news you watch. Sensitivity to those around you is more important than a thousand and one worrying thoughts about the protection of what's going on in the world. Hopefully there's some semblance of peace around you and to stay focused on what is good, what is true, what is light. Astrology is fundamentally about light, the light of the sun, which is the consciousness of our solar system. And it radiates out. You have a sun inside you. It is in your heart in your solar plexus, in your center of your being, and it needs to shine in order for this world to keep moving, keep turning. There is great hope, and there is always hope for the future. Be well, everyone, and I will see you next time.